the winery is the leading winery in Sonoma and instrumental in developing the Alexander Valley Appalachian in Sonoma County. The vineyards stretch from the banks of the Russian River up to the south facing hillsides. Alexander Valley Vineyards produces 20 wines from 11 states. I'm pleased to introduce Drew Vandenberg, our regional manager, and their winemaker, Kevin Hall, who is going to discuss the wines and give an overview of the winery. Please give your attention and warm up. Welcome to Kevin. Hi, I'm Stuart Vandenberg from Alexander Valley Vineyards, and I want to introduce you to Kevin Hall. Uh, he's the winemaker and been with us uh, for oh, about 15 years now. 14, 14 years. Just seems like 15 years. Uh, that's the night. <laughs> uh, Alexander Valley Vineyards is uh, located in uh, Sonoma County, right outside the town of Healdsburg. Uh, we've been a winery since 1975 owned by the uh, Wetzel family that bought the property back in 1962 from the heirs of Cyrus Alexander, the person that the Alexander Valley is named after. Um, the oldest son of the Wetzel family is Hank Wetzel. He was the original winemaker, uh, and he is our uh, general manager and the, uh, the one who uh, runs the winery these days. And he's said on numerous occasions that the best decision he ever made was hiring Kevin as the winemaker. Uh, and so, uh, there you go. <laughs> Tell us all about all, all right. the wines. <laughs> I will. All right. So, uh, if anybody knows anything about winemakers, you know that we're more at ease being in the vineyard or a barrel room. So, bear with me. I'm not used to holding a microphone and talking about my wines. But, um, we got six wines tonight. The first wine that you tried was our Gewürztraminer, and it's our one and only wine that's sourced from vineyards outside of the Alexander Valley. So, um, Mendocino County is to the north of us. It's a much cooler growing region, uh, so it does better on a very aromatic grape like Gewürztraminer. Gewürztraminer gives you a really great, lively wine, really aromatic. You get pineapple, rose petal. Um, it's a great, we just call it a great porch sipper wine. Uh, night like tonight, sit out on the veranda or porch. Wonderful acidity, great food wine. Then we move into the next wine we're trying. It's our state Chardonnay. And I always say I like to make the Chardonnay in, uh, I use two different techniques. I have barrel fermented and I have pig fermented. So this wine is a blend of both. It's 30% barrel fermented and 70% stainless steel tank. I like to add that tank fermented in so you get a chance to see what Chardonnay actually tastes like. It doesn't taste like an oak barrel. It doesn't have to taste like buttered popcorn. It's a really great gravy see why it's the most widely planted grape in California. Um, but really, once again, a really great food style wine. And by that I mean there's great fruit, but the acidity is kept a little higher so that it cuts through all different types of food. Really great pairing. And then we're going to move into some of our reds. I have a Zinfandel tonight called Sinzin. I've been making that since 1978. I have a Merlot. I also have our estate Cabernet. That's, that's the main grape that we're known for in Alexander Valley. Phenomenal growing region in Alexander Valley. Very soil types, very weather, so that we're able to grow all these different grape varieties. It's just not one grape variety that dominates. And then the last wine that we get to have tonight, it's a very special wine, it's our Bordeaux blend. It's called Cyrus. We named it after Cyrus Alexander, the namesake of the valley. And that's a blend of Cabernet, Merlot, Cap Franc, and Petit Verdot. Very special wine. It takes only the top lots from each vintage to go into that one. But please stop on by. We have the wines at both tables. It's duplicate tables. Stuart and myself will be able to answer any questions, hopefully, that you might have about the winery or the wines. But mainly, enjoy yourself tonight, and thank you for coming out. Thank you.